So you may be in a position where for some reason you need to go ahead and update your payment method within your iPhone. So to do this, it's actually very easy and Apple wrote a humongous article basically explaining exactly how to do this. And by following this, you can actually go ahead and update your payment method. So to start off, what we want to do is we want to go ahead and add our new payment method. So even if it's an older one that didn't work out properly, you can go and update it by adding a new one. So what we can do here is we want to make our way over to our settings panel, just like this. We want to click on our name, which is on the top right there. And right here, you will see payment and shipping. All you want to do here is you want to go ahead and click on payment and shipping right there. And you'll come into another panel that basically will allow us to go ahead and either add a specific new payment method, delete existing ones, and so many other things. You may have to go and type in your passcode, so you want to go ahead and do that. Now, when you go ahead and do that, you're pretty much almost set up. Now, what you want to do here is you want to go ahead and add all of your specific payment method and information that is supposed to be set up in the first place. So here you can either connect your credit card, debit card, whatever. You can also connect a PayPal card is, or your PayPal account as well. And right here where it says number expires in CVV, this is probably the information that may have been messed up originally. So all you want to do here is you want to type in the proper you know, credit card number, your proper you know, expiration date, and your CVV, your security code. And that's all you have to do. Now you can also go ahead and click the camera instead. And you can also take a picture of the card if you'd rather do it this way. So that's another method you have. Most of the time you may just want to go ahead and just do it via card because that's probably going to be able to wait, you know, it's probably gonna be the easiest way to do it for majority people. But that's really all you have to do. Now, for some reason that's still not working out, you may want to go ahead and make sure you actually activated your credit card. You may just want to go through a payment method through PayPal. That may be a little bit easier. But those are pretty much the main ways to do it for the most part. So if you have any other questions or comments, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I got you guys in the next video. Peace out, till then.